In this video, I'm going to show you how to add an announcement bar on your Shopify site without using an app. An announcement bar is a great way to display a free shipping offer or a sale or other promotion. And there's really no need to use an app for this feature. Just copy a few lines of code from this tutorial and you'll be all set. And the code that I'm going to provide you will also let you show an optional free shipping countdown so that shoppers will always know how close they are to receiving free shipping. The first step is to open our theme editor in Shopify. And we can get there by clicking on online store. And this will take us to the themes page and go to actions, edit code. Next here in the sidebar of our theme editor, we'll go down to the sections folder and click add a new section. And we'll call it announcement dash bar. Next, we need to copy some code into that section. If you're watching this on YouTube, you can find the code here by going to envision.io forward slash announcement bar. And then under step three, click open this link. That'll open a new tab in your browser and go ahead and select all of that code, copy it. And then in the announcement bar section in the Shopify editor, we're going to select this existing code and just delete it and then paste in the, the new code that we have from this page here. Once you've pasted that code in, then go ahead and click save. And we are on to step four. So next we need to open theme.liquid in your theme editor. And that's up near the top in this folder called layout. So we'll click theme.liquid. And the thing that we're looking for, uh, it, will, it will vary depending on which theme you're using. We're using the launch theme and this is what it looks like. So it says section and then in single quotes, general dash header. Other themes might just call it uh, header or dynamic header. Um, but you're looking for something like something like this. It'll start with the word section. It'll have these brackets at the beginning and end, and it'll say something like header, general header. And it's usually pretty close to the body tag that you see here. Once you find that, then we're going to hit enter to bump it down a line, and we're going to paste in this line of code from step five. And this line of code says section announcement bar. So we'll just paste that in just above the existing header section that's in theme.liquid and save. Okay, that's all the code editing we have to do. So now we can just open your theme settings and start setting up this announcement bar. And you can get to the theme settings by clicking customize theme here from within the code editor. Or if you go back to the themes page, then you can just click the big customize button that looks like this. Okay, we are now in the theme customizer. And over on the left here, you'll see all the different uh, sections and settings that you can adjust for your theme. And you'll see that we now have a new section here called announcement bar. And that's because of the code that we just added. And so now if you click on that section, you'll see a bunch of settings that will allow you to control this announcement bar. So if we click this checkbox, show announcement, you'll see the announcement bar show up here at the top of your homepage right above the existing header. And if you want to, you can tell it to show only on the home page. You can um, adjust the header padding if, if necessary. And the reason for this is that some themes will have the header, like the, your logo and navigation, kind of show behind the announcement bar. So if you need to bump it down to make room, then you can adjust that slider. Uh, here you can control the text that shows up in, that, in, the, in the announcement bar. Uh, if you want to, you can show a free shipping countdown. And this tells the customer how much they need to add to their cart in order to receive, in order to receive free shipping. Uh, but this only appears when at least one item is in the cart. So to test this out, I'm going to save. And if we go to our uh, catalog and open up a product, and then we add that item to our cart. So we're now on our cart page, and the product that we added to the cart was $10. So now you can see up in the top bar here, it says add $40 to your cart to receive free shipping. And if we change this to have uh, three items in our cart and we update it, we'll see that the announcement bar updates to say add $20 to your cart to receive free shipping. And you can change the settings for what your free shipping threshold is and what the text should be when, uh, when the customer needs to add more to their cart to receive free shipping. And then you can also change the text that shows once they do qualify for free shipping. You can also add a link to the announcement bar so that it's clickable. 
you can change the background color, the text color, the link cover color, and the font size. So there's a lot that you can do here to play around with the settings and change uh, the content of this announcement bar. I hope you found that fairly easy to set up on your Shopify store, and I hope it saves you some money uh, so that you don't have to pay for a monthly app that provides this same functionality. And um, I hope you can take advantage of this to encourage your customers to increase the, uh, the amount of items in their cart. This is a great way to increase your average order size by getting people over that free shipping threshold and uh, also to promote things like sales. So uh, good luck with your store and feel free to reach out to me if I can help you with anything.